So today we're going to go race a home meet at Michigan just um, to kind of practice going through the motions of racing and standing on the starting line and being nervous and, and going all out and uh, all that jazz. So yeah, kind of just a, a practice round before Melrose. We'll just normally kind of mope around all morning, hang out, eat breakfast, um, go for a shakeout at some point, then show up to the meet, get hype, race hard. Okay, well I like bread. I like toast with my favorite food, so gotta have the toast, some scrambly eggs, uh, and you know, so I stay full longer, some uh, some fruit, you know, micronutrients and stuff, and then some yogurt. So I like yogurt, so that's uh, that's what we're doing for breakfast this morning. Yo, here we go. Well, you know, every once in a while, as being a Star Wars fan, you can't just be like watching YouTube videos. You gotta reconnect with your roots and watch the OGs. So that's what we're doing. We're getting back to our roots. And uh, yeah. Which which movie are we watching? We're gonna start with uh with Episode Four today, Star Wars the original. It was just called Star Wars when it came out. So I don't I don't really like the name A New Hope. Why not? It's kind of cringe, man. It, it was like not originally called New Hope, it was just called Star Wars, and Empire Strikes Back, and Return of the Jedi. But the first one is always Star Wars. Malrose is a very prestigious means. What's your mindset going into it? Um, I just want to get in there and uh, execute a race I can be proud of. That's I don't really have any time goals or place goals. I just want to um, race in a way I can be proud of. They still stand a chance. No chance. Clock's old, washed, steepler. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> he's gonna he's gonna make you grind all race. No. Did that serve any purpose? Uh, just, so just confidence booster. I am. Just a confidence I win, booster. I, I could win any event here, including Oof. the 60 hurdles. Oof. See what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two hurdles for the first time in two years. Good. Now you're not like me. It's like riding a bike. <laughs> How do you come back? Oh, when I'm nervous, it's terrible because you like want to keep doing strides or whatever. I didn't really care about today at all, so I'm sort of actually it's fun because I'm. I feel like I'm finally being a cool, calm Kenyan who just lies down and doesn't really care about it. They seem to not be phased by any of this. So. Even at the end of my career, I'm practicing something new. Feeling good? Yeah, this time schedule is just yeah. terrible. No wonder people hate track. How do, you, how do you deal with that as an athlete? Looks like today's not an Olympic final, so. Yeah, good thing. Yeah, we're just gonna be comfortable with our first two thirds, 2K of the race, so. Use that to warm up into it, you know, after sitting around for 45 minutes now, so. No biggie. Practice closing, practice race instincts. That's, uh, those are our outcome, pro progress goals for today, I should say. No, no outcome goals.
30 or better to break eight minutes for the flat 600. And that for Hobbs was a 30.11. How'd dad do? Dad do good? Woo! Recap Roo. How you feeling? How'd it go? Feeling good. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if you're gonna throw the race in the video at all, but yeah, yeah. plan was just like chill for the 2K no matter what happened, just not lead, just practice getting bumped around. And there's something about sitting in the pack. You always feel less comfortable than you think you will, you know? And so like, it's like 65, so it shouldn't be fast. It just feels weird, because you're trying to relax as much as possible, but you're also trying to like keep position. So that was good practice, just knowing that like, okay, hey, you gotta like, you gotta reframe what the race is when you're in, trying to be in cruise control. And then like the goal is to run the last K, like spicy, just have a transition where it's like, okay, five laps, let's go into a, a higher gear and like just press a little bit. And that felt great, actually. Like, uh, you know, I think I took two laps, and then Hobbs took over like 600 to go, and we just kept like, you know, running about 30 points, and I don't know, probably ran another 230 for last K, which was awesome. And uh, yeah, like, you know, not never easy, but very comfortable. You yeah, know? so that's good. Uh, we had a great workout on Wednesday, and so I come back with this. That was perfect. Good perfect tune up for next week. And stuff. Yeah. How about Nick hanging in there? I thought he was gonna get you. He was chopping my heels, or. The last couple of laps, I thought for sure he was gonna blow by us at 150 to go. I was like, I kept on feeling him like, oh man, he feels good or something. So I'm actually surprised. I want to ask him if he was just letting us have it. Because no. uh, I, I, he went like this. Oh, uh, he's great. Yeah. Part of me was, it was good to Hobbs get that win. That was yeah. great. I think that was a really good confidence builder for him going into next weekend, knowing that he can push the last couple laps uncomfortable. You saying you let him win? No. <laughs> <laughs> Off the record. Yeah. Uh, but that was good. I, it was perfect. We t tackled that as a team. Yeah. And that's what it was about today. It wasn't about anyone trying to prove anything. It was like, as a unit, can we yeah. can we run well? Yeah, can we run yeah. snappy? Yeah. Yeah. What would you grade it? What would you grade it? What? What would you grade it? A plus. What are you eating? Twizzlers? What are you eating? All right, well, good work. Oh, yeah, thanks. Just chips? Wow. I'm gonna get a burger. With what toppings? Um, well, I bought some bacon here, but Sierra said in America you don't, can't use bacon on grills because there's no hot plate on it. Everyone loves a bacon burger. It's your favorite food. <laughs> it, would, it would be charred, like charred bits of wood. Actually, I'm gonna go some guac on my burger. I'm gonna do a Southwest burger. 
chips, guac. How many calories do you think are in a burrito tortilla? <laughs> how, how many calories in, in the burger? 850. The bun, the bun is worth, the bun is worth like 300, right? How about these? Alright, three, two, one. See that one? Okay, we're on the wheel. Was that? It was her. <laughs> Again. <laughs> is this the, is this the setting? That's yeah. That's, that's four. Four. That was, that's what it was on. Dude, that's oh, someone's gonna die. Someone's gonna die. I live to tell the tale. Anyone got heart problems here? <laughs> Whatever part of the hand it's touching, like, is like. Alright, Hobbs, you and I. Okay, we, His hand has gotten shocked enough to where I don't think I'm going to get worse. It feels weird. It's not a four. It's like, it's really weird. It's not a four. It's like, 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 it's I was only concerned about the last thousand meters. I wanted 230 and ran 229.8. Perfect execution. Why didn't you tell them to wait to 600 and then I could have smoked them in the last bit? I, I actually told them that if they, if they don't get it going, I said you can't have the old man hanging around because if he smells blood, you're in trouble. I almost had it. Yeah. Almost. Almost counts in horseshoes and. Alright, well. Tell the people goodbye. Tell them thanks for. Uh, Thanks for supporting. Good night. Thank you for supporting a uh, very nice guy club. And uh, uh, we'll get, we'll get well, tuned up right. next week and get ready for a workout on Tuesday to get ready for uh, uh, where are we going? Nick, New York, York City. And what are we going to do? Break four. There we go. And that's it. Thank you much. Very nice track club. Peace, man out.